Hello Cancer and welcome to your monthly reading. This is your reading for the month of April 2018. Okay, what's coming into focus is, you know, I do see a little bit of stress with um, maybe finances, okay? Money is coming in, but I do see stress with finances. Now you have a tower right here in the middle, but this is also change of perspective, change. Um, there are some changes going on. Um, what I do feel here is I have seen here, um, you may be a little bit more private behind the scenes, doing things behind the scenes, a little bit more quiet to yourself, but you are manifesting from your own intuition too. Okay. So that's very important. Okay. There's a sense of a little being, being a little bit mysterious too. There is some hurt feelings here. I feel it's you being hurt and it's got to do with some kind of past or, um, or current or a partnership or something like that. Um, definitely count your blessings, okay? Because we got it does tell me here that you need to count your blessings. Now there can be um, choices to be made, okay? I do see some decisions coming through, and this could be with um, where you invest your time, where you invest your money. Um, I do see you working and gaining. I do see that uh, that too, but I do see some second chances or. For some, it's second chances, and but, but for some, this is like your uh, returns coming in from your hard work from the past. It's almost like, you know, um, rewards, okay? So that's what I'm seeing there, too. There is someone on the side here that's still a little bit negative. It's like they're moving away, you know, someone that's been jealous, uh, that brings a little bit of negative energy um, into your life or to your home. Because, yeah, but there it's slowly drifting away. It's like that person or that situation has been there for a while, so, but it is moving away. Um, I do see indecision, and this could be with about love for some, or this could be a personal matter, okay? Um, this could be having trouble making up your mind also. You may have, be a little bit indecisive this month, like... Should you or shouldn't you type of energy is an example. Uh-huh. Like of a question that may be on your mind. Okay. So that's what I'm seeing there. You will know the answer soon though. Okay. You don't know the answers, but the answer is coming to you soon. There is a focus on um, family and like friends. Very nice, supportive and comforting energy. But you don't see eye to eye with everyone. Okay. That is another thing I'm seeing here, too. So it's like, it's either people you work with or you live with need to find, you need, you need to find a way to um, get along with. But for some, it's best to actually remove yourself from a toxic environment. So if the environment's very toxic, then you need to move away. If you choose not to, then you have to find a way to um, compromise. That is a message I'm getting here. Um, that would be the only way to resolve a personal problem, okay? Now, emotions could be running a little bit high this month, too. Um, I do see some healing and transformative um, energy towards the end, maybe, of the month more, because we're seeing that energy there. And the thing is, you're going to have to admit that there is a problem to yourself, if not to anyone else, to yourself. Okay, so that way you'll be able to heal and transform. That's one thing I'm seeing here. Now, a project is coming through or maybe a collaborative project that requires like extra hard work. Okay, you're going to have to put in extra hard work and adjusting some specifications and some details. Okay, I do see some discussions about this. Yeah, that's also showing up. Now, a person like a friend may ask you for advice and ask you to maybe fix something for them, okay? Or maybe even mediate something for them, okay? Use your creative talents to definitely generate more success. So you have to add a little bit more um, creativity or use those uh, talents, creative um, talents to be able to generate more success is a message I'm seeing here too. I do see there possibly could be a power struggle, okay? Um, there could be in just in general power struggles. I do see love and building on love, more satisfying love life, okay? Because we're seeing that building upon that. 
um, too. So there is something negative there that's going to be leaving. So we do see some broken stones when that indicates to me some hurt feelings, things like that. But I'm seeing here, it's like you may be questioning some things and feeling disconnected maybe from your intuition or from um, the universe, you know, your affirmations. You need to connect spiritually again. But you do need to protect yourself spiritually too. It's like there is something negative or people's opinions maybe is another thing that you shouldn't worry about or care about um, or who are trying to break you down. Okay, so that's one thing I'm seeing there. But you need to really connect spiritually. Um, questions that you've had or answers to some things, they're going to be coming in soon. You know, it's it's coming. Okay, so uh, hurt feelings and that that you had, that's really like in the center here too. So it's telling me... Um, it's things from the past or things uh, build up with people that have hurt you and that it's like you're dealing with it. There is transformative healing energy coming through here, but you definitely need, because it is, if it was up this way, you're still like dealing with it. You're not, but, but you're trying to put it to bed, okay? And build upon that and strengthening love or with the true people where you should be. So we do see a little bit of rocky road ahead here. Also pay attention to your health and your lifestyle, because don't let that affect you too. You need to, a balance between your personal life Work, home, family, your lifestyle is coming into focus here too. There is money coming in. I do see some stress with them. Maybe, I don't know if it's partnerships um, or money give and take. That needs a balance because this is in reverse. But I do see money coming in, okay? You got some beautiful energy here with money coming in, even though I do see some stresses. There is someone that's hurt you, but you're building. There's something uh, that you're changing there. And it, it is um, connected to matters of the heart and love. But we're definitely seeing building upon that. And this negativity. Now, a lot of things clustered here. We have um, another tower um, underneath here, too. It's like you're doing, like I already saw in the beginning, is you're doing things maybe more, you're quiet, doing things behind the scenes, keeping things a little bit more discreet, using your intuition, beautiful intuition. Oh, that's very powerful. I didn't even see that connected there. Yeah. And you keep being more to yourself. That's actually your power. Travel is showing up or something that you planned it may be coming soon, too, okay? Um, you're also pay attention to your health, but really communicating more clearly, um, putting more passion in, into some projects and that, but I do see you like moving forward and there could be travel coming up to it towards the end of the month. Anyway, cancer, that was your reading for the month of April 27, 20, I was going to say 2017. So maybe because I said that something maybe from last year, 2017, Either it's a subconscious energy or something could, I don't know. But this is your reading for April 2018th. And if you'd like a gemstone reading, my the link to my website is below this video. And uh, stay tuned to my weekly coffee cup readings for specific details for each week. And yes, I hope you have a wonderful month. And I will catch you back next month for your next, coffee, for your next gemstone reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.